Hi guys, my name is Hermit in the Forest. This is my unboxing of Catacomb. Well, time has come to unbox probably the rarest game in my collection so far. Uh, this game is so rare I never heard about it. There exists no info on the internet about it and I no, don't know anyone else who knows about its existence. It is a text-based role-playing game where you uh, create a party of up to four characters and have to descend into a catacomb that is called Bastille in this game. It is below Harbour Town and this Harbour Town is ruled by the Duke. The Duke sends you there because on the lowest level, on the 11th level, there are 11 levels of Bastille in total. So on the lowest level there is uh, an artifact called a Golden Scepter that was stolen from him and you are there to retrieve it. Of course on the way you collect uh, treasure for yourself and level up, get even stronger than you were, like in all role-playing games. Actually the interaction isn't text, however. It is, um, there is text written on the written on the screen, however you control the game by hotkeys actually, so it's quite uh, strange. I didn't play it myself, but it is written so in the manual. You will see for yourself. Okay, uh, let's take a look at the box art now. Uh, it is very complex RPG actually. There is about 60 different commands that you can give to your party. Very nice artwork on the box. However, there is no, there are no pictures on the uh, from the game on it or in the manual or any other material. Yeah, this was supposedly released by Fantasine uh, Enterprises from uh, Santa Monica in California, but. There is no info about them as well on the internet, so I don't know who those guys were. And supposedly it was released in 1988 for the IBM PC computer. Okay, now let's remove the sleeve. It is a sleeve style box. Beneath there is this white cardboard. If I open it, you can actually see that there are such nice stickers that hold the box together. On one sticker there is written Fantasane and on the other there is written Open Here. Okay, so here we get the first item inside. It is a registration card with an address, however, sadly it is just PO box, so not a regular address. And here is the sales agreement. Okay, inside this is just basic registration card that you should fill in and yeah, quick reference card how to start playing the game. Okay, uh, then there is the game itself of course. It comes on one five and quarter inches disc. This is how it looks like. And the last thing in the box is the uh, catacomb booklet and instruction manual, again by Fantasine. Uh, it is written in this style. Here you can take a look at the table of contents. So it has over 30 pages as you can see. And here is the introduction, how the, what is catacomb and what is the object of catacomb, how uh, the story started and such. Also there is a tutorial present in these lines, uh, how to create your character and go through the first part of the game. You are of course traveling through Harbour Town where you can buy items or uh, speak with important figures and then go down into the catacomb called Bastille where you fight monsters and get treasures for uh, trading upstairs and such and of course you have to gain enough experience 
to finally defeat the strongest of monsters and get the golden scepter in the end. Okay, and now I will show you here. I've written all the commands uh, that you can do. There are six different menus and each menu has ten different commands. So 60 commands total and here you can see them in detail or the commands. So it looks really like a complex, maybe even it could be an adventure game in part because so many various commands are quite uh, unusual for a role-playing game. So here they are, yeah, all the commands and on the last page there is something about the mob sec map section. On the back side of the menu again all the commands together. Okay, and that is all that was in this box. I thank you very much for watching this video.